Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Cave Story Plus. So in the last episode, we got into the egg corridor and found out that Sue was actually not where she we thought she was. Uh, as it turns out, she was actually nowhere to be found here. We haven't seen her since, but what we do know is that she is missing and there were red petals where she was uh, last found. Like, last known to be? I don't really know how to put it. I'm, I'm sorry for that lame excuse of an intro, but it's just the way it is. I keep wanting to use my control stick to control things, and that's just, it won't work. I'm trying to level up the, uh, ow. Uh, gun, but I keep misclicking things. Okay, I'm gonna shoot with my pop start. And then collect with this gun out so I can level up. Go back to shooting with this and get another heart that I actually didn't need. Got you. Alright. Have both of those done. And we're in. Insert the ID card. Shield removed. Got more experience with this gun. I feel like we're gonna need it. Come on, just one experience point away. Oh my. Alright, now that I have my uh, favorite little pea shooter over here, I can move on. And this boss fight is going to require me to use this missile. I know this is going to be a boss fight. Hey, Sue! Monster Sue! I know it's you! Professor's very important test eggs. Very important. Won't let anyone near them. So I just dealt 66 damage. As you can tell, I'm empty. Crap. So I could just get past Sue. Oh no. Oh no. Ah, come on. I did not jump that with good timing. How did I make it out of that range? Dang it, jumped right into it. But got Sue dead. This has to be Sue, right? Right? Defeated Igor. Oh, it was Igor, apparently. Rabid Miga. Alright, well, I'm gonna save real quick. Never mind. Egg number double O. Ugh. Ouch. <laughs> Whoa there! I haven't lost yet! I'm gonna take it serious now! H huh? I got knocked out by that monster. Did you save me? Well, let's be honest, yes. This is none of your business! I can take care of myself! I hate this island and every living thing on it! Oh, so this is Sue. Oh, this this must be it. Egg number double O. We can get off the island with this egg. Egg condition is normal. Awesome! Hmm? Huh, password? It looks like I need a password to hatch this egg. Meh. If my big brother were here, he'd fix everything. There's nothing to do here, I guess. I'm out. Really? Um, are you from this island? You don't seem like you are. The letters on your cap aren't from here. Maybe you're lost? Fine. I'll let you come with me. We can get off this island together. 
if you want. But in return, you're gonna have to help me. Yep, requires a password that I do not have. Oh, save room. While I'm here, heal for sure. It also refills your uh, missiles, so I don't know why you wouldn't do that. Oh, come on. Really? There we go. Well, thanks to the fact that that uh, big one's really stupid, I don't have to worry about it. I love bad fall paths. Ah, come on. There we go. Got my level up back, healed up, don't have to go in there, because honestly I don't want to. That would reset everything here. And while I love fighting and all, there's no point to it. All right, let's move on back up here. All right, done. So this is all just backtracking here. I'm not gonna try for that little area I should call it I don't know it was the life capsule down at the bottom I'm not gonna attempt it because honestly it's not a smart thing for me to attempt ignore those two guys since they don't have to die destroy everything that is in my path though because you know clever and smart things I'm not even gonna bother trying to talk to him teleport to Arthur's house now still Curious who this guy is. Connecting to network. Logged on. Starting I am chat. Kazuma, are you there? You okay? Sue? Is that really you, Sue? Yeah, it's me. Sue Sakamoto, your sis. So were you able to escape too? Where are you at now? I found the dragon eggs. Is mom with you? I have a few questions about this. The door is jammed and I can't get out of here. I'm still in a shelter looking sort of room. By the way, the code that you need to teleport is Bushlands. Try searching from your end. And no, mom isn't with me. I'm, I'm afraid she might be with the doctor. Are any of the flying dragon eggs about ready to hatch? I found one that's almost ready to hatch, but it's locked up with a password. Can we do something about that? Retrieving your information for Kazuma. Complete. Bushland Structor D. Currently searching for functional teleporters. Preparing connection with bushlands. Anyhow, I'm on my way to go to help you. Just stay right there. Roger that. And do me a favor, bring some food back on your way. User Sue is disconnected. Uh... Is that boy ready yet? Hmm? Welcome back. I've been waiting. Now what? I'm busy. Turco has been taken by, by the doctor. Taken to the doctor. What? And we're holding you responsible for this. Let go of me! I'm not going to do that voice for her every time. That's... It would kill my voice. Welcome back. Sue's returned. We locked her up inside a cage up atop the village. When the doctor's gang come, we'll give them to Sue in exchange for Toriko. I feel bad for Sue, but Toriko, she's one of us. We don't need someone like Sue who only thinks of herself and no one else. I'm gonna keep my comments on that to myself. Amiga Village. Let me out of here now! Shut up! Toriko was taken by mistake because of you. One way or another, I'm handing you over to them. I hate you! If Toriko isn't safe, I'm gonna tear you apart. This is awkward. Uh, what do you have to say on the matter? <clears throat> oh, it's you. Sue's been taken upstairs. They said the reason Toriko was kidnapped. They said she was the reason, you know, I meant. Freaking idiot. Saying your line's wrong. <laughs> All 
All right, right up here. And this is what happens to those who defy the order of the village. I've been caught. The doctor's men mistook another Amiga for me and kidnapped her instead. That girl Toroko, she treated me so well when I had trouble getting used to everything. I have an idea. You can go in my place. My brother Kazuma is stuck in an area called Bushlands. Bring him back here. Okay, well, that means I have to use the teleporter. Awkward! I guess I have to teleport all by myself. Better do that. It's a teleporter. Uh, let's go to the Bushlands. This looks slightly familiar and yet not at all familiar. Hello, my name is Santa. I want to get some water. I want to get some water and was attacked by those monsters, so I ran back home. But I dropped my key on the way back. Now I can't get into my house, into my own house. Uh, good job, Santa. Mr. Claus would be proud of you. Excuse me. Oh, you're a soldier from the surface. Hasn't the war ended already? No matter. If you want to venture any further, be mindful of those big blue critters. They'll try to crush you. Whatever you say, uh. Mr. Guy? Oh, these. this isn't a. Oh. They can fly now. Interesting. Uh. There we go. All taken care of. Not a problem at all. Well, seriously though, these monsters are nothing but fodder for my gun. <laughs> And it's all taken care of. Jump up here. I'm not sure what the point of that was. Uh. Oh, oh, gave the key. Obtain Santa's key. So I can bring that back to him now if I want to. I wish I knew how to. Hmm. All right. I'm just gonna go back to Santa. I have no idea what to do there. Uh, I'll have to figure out. Maybe I get an ability to do that later. I'm not positive. Oh! That's the key to my house! Return Santa's key. Thank you! Please come over. I have something nice for you. Well, this might be an upgrade. Let's hope it's an upgrade, guys. I could save and all that, but I don't know why I would. Danger, this trap is instant death. Use extreme caution. Well, yeah. Thanks again for the help earlier. I'd like to give you something. Obtain the fireball, a gift from Santa. <laughs> Are you looking for someone? I haven't seen anyone around here, but if you plan on going any further in, you'll need to go through the fireplace inside Chaco's house. Flames below, charcoal's burden in Santa's fireplace. Okay, well, apparently Chaco is around somewhere, and I have to go through the fireplace in his house. I'm not sure how the ammo on this works. Is there just infinite ammo? Just the catches, you can only have a few out one at a time. Yeah, from the looks of it, that's how it is. This is really easy to use. But not the best for the flying fat guys. Ha! He was stupid enough to try to fly at me like that. Come on. There we go. Come on, trying to get to level 3 with this. I want to see what happens. Is it just more of them? Wait. I need to get those. There we go. I'm glad I used the fireballs because that told me that that, was, uh, that pit was actually a pit. Well. Uh... Let's head in here. This is probably Chaco's house. Hey, Chaco. Hi, how may I help you? 
Wow, that thing you have there looks quite dangerous. I wonder, are you a traveler? You see a hole on the other side of the building flames. You can't get past the fire, though. You want to go through my fireplace? For that, you're going to need to get a bit of jellyfish juice. That big jelly has it. Uh, I apparently need to fight something and kill it. Uh, these were not here before. I want to point that out. Uh, I don't think I go back this way. I'm not sure... Did I do it right? If you want to put out the fire, then you need to get some jellyfish juice. You can get your hands on some jellyfish juice from the jellies. Go for the biggest one. Uh... I'm not sure what you're referring to. How would I... How would I... Where... Maybe there's some over here. Maybe they just spawned over here. Yep, a bunch of them spawned over here. Alright. Alright. Come on. Get back to max level. Even got some hearts in the process. Ah, there's the jellyfish. I got it. Let's kill everything. You know, before it kills me. Alright. not have stood there and took those hits, but I did anyway. Open the treasure chest to get the jellyfish juice. I'm still curious, though. Is... Is there a way I can do this right now? I just immediately fell off, of course. Uh... Come on. Oh, maybe I'm not supposed to... Uh... I just realized how well my health is. I just looked over and saw that. Alright, got some more health like that. And like that. I'm glad it's dropping so many things I need. Alright, I'm gonna drop by Santa's house over here, uh, and then I'm gonna make an attempt at that. Life and missiles refilled. Glad I did that. Even if it was a complete waste. There we go. Level up to level three. I'm level 3 again. I'm level 3 again. Come on. Got you as well. The problem is that that stupid jelly is there again. I thought it would despawn permanently. Maybe if I can drag it away? On. There we go. Got it. Alright. I think this is going to be the last thing I do this episode because this is like 20 minutes in. It's perfect. Okay. That was a totally useless effort. Alright. That didn't work. I know I got in that hole at least once. And also, that's what she said. Come on. Come on.
Come on. Come on, I can do this. I know I can do this. I, I can possibly do this. I've done this at least once before. Break that, maybe it's a confidence thing. <sighs> I'm gonna hope this is actually something I need to do later and that I'm just not a complete and utter failure. Yeah, I think it's something for later. It's not something I need to worry about now. Or at least that's what I'm going to tell myself as I, uh, you know, try not to just beat myself up over the fact that that was probably actually a decently easy jump. Alright, so guys, in Chaco's house, next time on Let's Play Cave Story Plus, we're going to be passing through Chaco's fireplace to get towards, uh, what was his name? Kazuma? Kaz Kazumi? Kazumi? I don't remember his name. His name is extremely Japanese. And I'm pretty sure that he's not a bunny, which confuses me why he's Sue's brother. I don't understand this. I'm sure I'll understand more later. Maybe Sue wasn't actually a bunny and she was actually some kind of, like, human that was transformed into a Mamiga. That's possible? Uh, they also apparently have a mother that's actually in this game. So that's, uh, that's interesting. <laughs> well, I'll see you guys next time.